Detection of nitrogen. The presence of nitrogen in an organic compound is shown by the following tests. 1. Soda-lime test. The given substance is mixed with double amount of soda-lime and heated in a test tube. The vapors of ammonia evolved show the presence of nitrogen. A negative result, however, is not a proof of the absence of nitrogen. Many classes of nitrogenous compounds including nitro and diazo derivatives, do not respond to this test. 2. Sodium test, Lassane's test. This is a good test for the detection of nitrogen in all classes of nitrogenous compounds. It involves the following steps. At the substance is heated strongly with sodium metal. Sodium plus carbon plus nitrogen react and give sodium cyanide. B. The water extract of the fused mass is boiled with ferrous sulfate solution. Ferrous sulfate plus 2 sodium hydroxide react and give ferrous hydroxide plus sodium sulfate. And. 6 sodium cyanide plus ferrous iodide react and give sodium ferrous cyanide plus sodium hydroxide. C. To the cooled solution is then added a little ferric chloride solution and concentrated hydrochloric acid. 3 sodium ferrous cyanide plus 4 ferric chloride react and give iron hexacyanoferrate plus 12 sodium chloride. The formation of Prussian blue or green coloration confirms the presence of nitrogen. Hydrochloric acid is added in this step to dissolve the greenish precipitate of ferrous hydroxide produced by the excess of sodium hydroxide on ferrous sulfate in step B, which would otherwise mark the Prussian blue precipitate. In case sulfur is also present along with nitrogen in the given organic compound, a blood-red coloration may appear while performing the above test. This is due to the formation of sodium sulfocyanide which again reacts with ferric chloride to produce blood-red coloration. Sodium plus carbon plus nitrogen sulfide react and give sodium sulfocyanide. 3 sodium sulfocyanide plus ferrous chloride react and give ferric sulfocyanide plus 3 sodium chloride. Blood red.